the tell. This is CBS. What's the best day to go to Showbiz Pizza? Adopt a teen. Be a foster parent. Hey, Bill and Ted will return after these messages. There's something new in Gotham City. It's Batman! Like you've never seen him before. Figures and vehicles sold separately. Larky does, Batman. My tech shield suit protects me. Even against this sludge, your poison can't hurt my tech shield suit. Bye, Batman. Think again, Joker. My Batcopter, fire! Yeah. Ah, where does he get these great weapons? You're finished, Joker. Tech Shield Batman, Batcopter and Joker sold separately. Part of Batman, the Dark Knight Collection. King's taking Homer, Marge, and all the Simpsons camping, including you-know-who. <laughs> now you can get one Simpsons character and camping scene in every kids' club meal at Burger King. The Burger King Kids Club, just for fun, just for you. Listen, here he comes. Wow, oh, Jack. Hey, we gotta finish our Cheerios. Yeah. It's part of this complete breakfast. Oh. Come on, guys. Some O's for the road. Okay, guys, ready to run back? You can get a free sticker and mark boxes of Cheerios, plus a chance to join the Bo Jackson fan club with your parents, okay? And now, back to Bill and Ted! We'll return after these messages. What's cool? California custom. Oh, yeah. Hot neon paint jobs, gnarly surfer stickers, cool speed, colored wheels, California custom. Oh, yeah. California style, California cool, California custom in slow motion. So hot, so cool. New California custom cars and Wild Wave stunt set each sold separately. Cars not for use with some sets. Check out my Rice Krispies. What's it saying? For you to go upstairs and make my bed. <laughs> Mine says Margie Daniels after me. My Rice Krispies say, Pop, pop, crackle, snap, pop, pop. I didn't know we could sing. <laughs> and now we're from Kellogg's Rice Krispies. The fun part of the complete breakfast. I can hear them speaking to me. <laughs> Who ever heard of a talking cereal? Be sure it's so busy my accent. What do your Rice Krispies say to you? Don't talk with your mouth full. <laughs> Cinnamon and chocolate. They are number one today. Teddy Grams are here to stay. No, there's no. Hey, we play off with Major Fun and his neck. Then you've got intense prehistoric action coming out with things of a little dinosaur. Kids should be on CBS for a kid, girl. It will only happen once. Witness. Creation. The Flash, premiering Thursday. And now, back to Bill and... Ted! And now, these messages. Pretty Cotton Girl, you need a haircut. I snip and clip your hair away. Pretty Cotton Girl, you're getting prettier every day. With Pretty Cut and Grow, you can really cut her hair. You can't do this for every other dog. Pretty Cut and Grow, you're getting prettier every day.
and it's easy to give her long hair again. I could twist and tie and trim this way. Pretty cut and cut and get it prettier every day. Pretty cut and grow comes with comb, barrette, scissors, and extra hair. Each sold separately from Play School. Hey, what do you do for fun? from Crayola that actually erases. Free, along with a mystery game sheet, and specially marked boxes of apple cinnamon Cheerios. Colorless scram sticks. You can collect all four, but this offer will disappear soon. And of course, this is Bikers for Likers. Native to North America, the biker species is known for its remarkable speed and the ability to digest dirt. In the wild, you can always observe the ooze, the muck, and something not unlike feather over a layer of what appears to be Levi's jeans. Let me tell you about my Uncle Buck. He's rude. He's crude. He's gambling! Uncle Buck, Monday. This is CBS. Elder literacy is important to each of these children. On October 13th and 14th, join children, parents, and friends at Houston Pastoral Hall to celebrate the first annual Children's Day USA. Come out and help us make Children's Day a rally day for stamping out illiteracy in America. Illiteracy. Join the 100 Club. Call 790-0100.
There's something new in Gotham City. It's Batman! Like you've never seen him before. Figures and vehicles sold separately. Why well, he does, Batman? My tech shield suit protects me. Even against this sludge, your poison can't hurt my tech shield suit. Bye, Batman. Think again, Joker. My Batcopter, fire! Yeah! Ah, oh, where did you get these great weapons? You're finished, Joker. Batcopter, part of Batman, the Dark Knight collection. Tech Shield Batman and Joker sold separately. taking Homer, Marge, and all the Simpsons camping, including you-know-who. Ah! Now you can get one Simpsons character and camping scene in every kids' club meal at Burger King. The Burger King Kids' Club, just for fun, just for you. Now, back to Pee-wee's Playhouse. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, hi boys and girls. I'm going to play with my new toy. <laughs> Close. <laughs> I didn't want to play with this crummy toy anyway. <laughs> hey, let's go see what today's secret word is. <laughs> word is around <laughs> now you all remember what to do whenever anyone says a secret word right <laughs> that's right for the rest of the day whenever anyone says a secret word scream really loud ready let's try it hey globy would you tell me where china is sure peewee let me just turn around <laughs> Oh, nothing. 
Well, then why the long face and the uh, long coat? <laughs> I spilled a little bit of my lunch on myself. Oh, just a little? <laughs> Actually, the entire smorgasbord. <laughs> I'm on my way to the laundrette. Do you need anything clean? Oh, how thoughtful. As a matter of fact, I've got a couple of suits that could use some cleaning. <laughs> okay. Wait right here. <laughs> around the house. One of his chores is to fetch the newspaper. Oh, there's the paper now. I can hardly wait to see what happened to Dick Tracy. Here is a group of cute little piggies playing in the mud. Well, what are they up to? They seem fascinated by that clock. Oh, well. Here is one of the strangest friendships that has ever been known. Natural enemies get living together as friends. A cat and a mouse. Tell me, is it true that the cat takes good care of you? And keeps you nice and warm? Well, that's truly a friendship. Now, before we leave you, is there anything that you would like to say to your friends in the audience? The day draws to a close, and the sun sinks slowly in the west. We reluctantly take our leave of the farm. Well, the piggies again. Are they going to stay there all night? What in the world can the attraction be?
Today for snack time, we're going to have cornflakes. Mmm. <laughs> now, first we need some cornflakes. <laughs> Duh. Next, we need some milk. Just soften them up. <laughs> enseñarte a dónde el robo te puede llevar. Debí escucharte, el hombre. Esto es lo que puede pasar cuando coges las cosas que no te pertenecen. Gracias, el hombre. What's the matter, Pee-wee? Nothing. You don't sound happy. Would you sound happy if your suit, your cereal bowl, and your best spoon were missing? No, I wouldn't. Maybe I could look for your stuff while I fly around. Hey, that's a good idea, Terry. I could give you pictures of my stuff and you could recognize it. Great, Pee-wee. I'll get my photo album from a secret hiding place. <laughs> Under your bed? Right. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> 
Well, do you see it? Hmm. That's funny. I'm positive I put my photo album under the bed, and now it's missing. My photo album is missing! Oh, oh no! First, my soups are missing. Then my special cereal bowl and spoon are missing. Now, my photo album is missing! It's the weirdest day I've ever had. Why are all your favorite things disappearing, Pee-wee? I don't know. It's a mystery! I said it's a mystery! Mystery! Thank goodness we still have our penny cartoon! that my dad cook like fish, zucchini, string beans, broccoli, cauliflower. I just make myself eat it. And then when my dad's not looking in the other room, I make him so healthy, I put some of mine on his plate. But I wish we could Korean food. I love Korean food. Korean girls are in my school and they taught me what to eat and how to use chopsticks. They think they know everything, which they do. Time to play with me, Pee-wee. Okay, Magic Spring. <laughs> Gone, Jerry. You can't connect one dot. Maybe you misplaced them. Look around. I didn't misplace them. I always keep them in my pocket. Look, no dots. Where did they go? I don't know. It's a mystery. That does it. I have had enough. They can take the suit off your back. They can take your special cereal bowl and spoon. They can even take your album of photo memories. But when they mess with your dots, they go too far. Pee-wee Glam will return after these messages. <laughs> Machine man here, I live for the night, so I carry my own light, micro lights. Just touch them like so, they really glow. What a bright idea. You can try these micro machines lighted sound vehicle packs, each with an itty bitty building, a real glowing emergency light, and two super sounds that sound so super. And you can check out these super micro lights with lights that glow and passengers to go. What do you know? Micro machines, the real one, the original one. Micro machines, micro lights, lighted sound vehicles, and super micro light vehicle packs, each sold separately from Galoob. Yeah. It's part of this complete breakfast. Whoa. Come on, guys. Some O's for the road. Let's go. Okay, guys. Ready to run back? You can get a free sticker and marked boxes of Cheerios. Plus a chance to join the Bo Jackson fan club with your parents, okay? And now, uh -huh. back to Pee Wee's Playhouse. Duh. I 
guess you're all wondering why I asked you here today. No. Uh -uh. We're here every day. Actually, I was wondering. I asked you here today so that I could solve the mystery of my missing item. Chandelier. Oh, can I help you, Wee? Can you shed some light on the problem? Oh, Wee. Mm, it's brighter. All right, that's enough, Chandelier. Thank you. What about you, Mrs. Vaughn? What about me? I'll ask the questions. Perhaps you borrowed my cereal bowl, broke it, and then were too embarrassed to tell me, so you threw it away. The peewee, I don't eat cereal for breakfast. I prefer poached eggs on toast point. I didn't think you took it anyway. Mm. But what about you, Terry? Me? Mm? Yes, a prehistoric bird like you needs a change of clothes once in a while. Maybe you pluck my suits out of my closet. Oh, no, Pee-wee. I would never do that. Oh, I know you didn't do it. But you, Cherry. It's been a while since you've been reupholstered. Perhaps you were looking for something in a nice connect-the-dots pattern. Pee-wee, you know I wouldn't wear dots. They make me look heavy. I knew that. And what of you, Chicky Baby? You love looking at my photo album. Seen it around? <laughs> Sorry, baby. Well, if none of you took my stuff, then there's only one solution. Only one suspect left. Who's that, Pee Wee? Me! I did it! I did it and I don't remember doing it! I must be going crazy! I... I must be going crazy! 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 I must be... Hold it! Who are you? Nobody. Hold it, nobody! Where do you think you're going? That's my cereal bowl, that's my cereal spoon, this is my photo album, and you're wearing my suit. What are you doing with all my stuff? Putting it back. Bye. Hold it, hold it, hold it. I'm calling the police. <gasps> police! Police! Oh, please, please. Mr. Pee Wee, please. You'll get the chair for this. <laughs> But, Mr. Pee-wee, I just, I just... Tell it to the district attorney! Police! 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 Just a moment, Pee-wee. Hi. Hi. Why did you take Pee-wee's things? Well, I'm new to the neighborhood, and I don't have any friends. Oh. I saw how many wonderful people come to visit you all the time. So I figured I could have lots of friends, too. I tried to be just like you. <laughs> but I felt real bad. I was trying to sneak the stuff back in before you found out about it. Fascinating story. Please send me a letter all about it from jail. <laughs> just a moment, PV. You don't have to pretend to be someone else to make friends. I don't? No. All you have to be is yourself. Which brings us to another question. Who are you? My name is Busby. Hi, Busby. Hi, Busby. Hi, Busby. Hi, Busby. Hi everybody. Hey, Pee Wee. Can Busby be our friend? Okay. Yay! Stuff back, Pee Wee. Thanks, Busby. Oh, better give you this too. Oh, that's all right. Keep it. Thank you. Till you get a queen. <laughs> well, finally the mystery has been solved. <laughs> Bye, Busby. Bye-bye, everybody. Bye, Bye Pee-wee. 
<laughs> See you around! <laughs> <laughs> By the way, who are you? It's a mystery. for some awesome prehistoric adventures in all new Jake the Little Dinosaur is next, right here on Kid TV. a happy childhood, remember these simple rules. Get plenty of exercise. Eat well-rounded meals. Share with others. Never, never push or shove. Any questions? Dismiss. For AIDS information, call 524-AIDS. Hi, 
think, do you think it's possible for there to be two? Hiya, scat. Oh, no, three of them. Three of whom? Well, that's the third scat we've seen this morning, Ding. Oh, gosh, oh, golly. Maybe we're all in the same dream. Oh, three scats? That's no dream, that's a nightmare. Come on, let's see what's going on. Looks like a lot of scats went this way. I'll take a look. It can't be! This is terrible! It's... it's... an army of scats! We're doomed! <laughs> Sorry, old-timer. What's you you're calling old-timer, son? Are you okay, Krusty? No, I'm upside down. Here, I'll help you. <laughs> Where did all of you come from? We come from Honey Fruit Valley. <laughs> Honey Fruit Valley? <laughs> That's perfect. Where else would an army of scats live? <laughs> Matt, family, we chased away by Honey Fruit Monster. <laughs> Oh, thanks, give Scat idea. 
tomato sauce that's a shark hunt in every bowl. Catch all three shark shapes, you win! Thank goodness for Chef We now return to our story. Come on, we're almost there. We made it just in time. Just in time for what, Krusty? Yeah, you still haven't told us why we came up here. Krusty, tell us! Well now, just give me a minute. That was a long climb for my poor old feet. For you, maybe. My feet don't hurt at all. But my wings sure are tired. So where's this trailblazer guy, Krusty? Oh, he'll be around, but not down here. In the sky? He's got wings like me. Uh-huh, in the sky. But he doesn't have wings. He comes here every year to see how his valley's doing. No way! Hey, 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 hey. Huh? Just watch the sky. You see, Trailblazer was the first dinosaur to ever live here millions of years ago. In those days, Green Meadow was a harsh place. Storms brewing, volcanoes going off. Then, one day, a herd of dinosaurs came down from the north looking for food. Uh, what they look like? Some of them looked like us, except they were huge, like mountains compared to you and me. Ooh, golly! Like thunder, they stomped into the valley for the first time. Were they mean? They had to be. No, they were settlers. They came in families. Children played despite the obvious dangers around them while their folks struggled to find a new home. So they picked our place, right? But you said Green Meadow was a dump. Dink. Well, Green Meadow was a hazardous place. But you see, they had Trailblazer to lead them. There's food here. Come on. Now stay close to me. Did your mother tell you? Stay close. Dad? Patch, we're in a new place. We don't know what dangers lurk here. Until your mother says different, you stay put. Boy, Trailblazer sounds loud. He had to be, to protect his children. <laughs> you see, when there's food for plant eaters, there's food for meat eaters. <laughs> Oh, Shyla, why, even Tyranna would be scared of these meat eaters. Dinosaurs had little courage when faced with meat eaters. Ah, uh, that's 
rescued you, right, Krusty? Oh, she would be rescued, all right. But not by Patch. Hmm, maybe. Club meal at Burger King. The Burger King Kids Club, just for fun, just for you. Have you heard the Apple Sweet Crunch? The Apple Sweet Crunch that went to Musk is part of this complete breakfast. The Apple Cinnamon! Cinnamon! Now you can get a Colorworks crayon stick from Crayola that actually erases. Free, along with a mystery game sheet. And specially marked boxes of apple cinnamon Cheerios. Color with scram sticks. You can collect all four, but this offer will disappear soon. Wanna check out the all new show on Saturday morning? Then Bubble Ride on some intense trip to style with its only new show. Whoa! Pill and Ted's excellent adventures. Followed by the party animal with the bizarro pad and talking furniture. Pee Wee's Playhouse. Oh, thank you, show not Kid TV. We're here. Myself, but you can still see the grooves in the ground where those boulders roll through. Wow. In fact, this mountain we're sitting on is the very one trailblazer split to make that big rock slide. Whoa. Wow. Oh, that's a crazy story, Krusty. My Uncle Longbeak knows all about these things, and he never told me that story. Now, now, wait a minute, Frapper. Just hold your wings. This story isn't over. You mean we have to listen to more? Why, sure. Unless you don't care if the herd stayed here or not. <laughs> After all that had happened, the herd was ready to follow Strongfoot. This place is too dangerous. It's time to leave. Follow me out of here. My family and I are staying. I still say we can make this a good home. Uh, something else is bound to happen, and you know it. We don't want to stay here and risk our lives. Yeah, yeah, we don't want to do that. They were chicken. No, Dink. They were rightfully scared. So long, Trailblazer. I'll lead the herd to safety now. the valley, their fate awaited. Oh no, they all died, didn't they? Well, they get eaten. Gosh, I don't want to hear anymore, Krusty. Why can't 
stop at the best part, Shiloh. Sharpshoots needs a bath. Trailblazer, we owe you our lives. And ever since, a mighty race of dinosaurs has ruled Green Valley. And that was the last they ever saw of Sharptooth and his meat eaters. Finally, Green Valley was a safe home for Trailblazer and his friends. And today, Tar Pit Pass is a reminder of that battle. The tar Trailblazer brought up from the ground still protects us from the meteors. Ah, there's Trailblazer coming up now. But how come he's in the sky, Krusty? To remind us that this is home, our home. Gee, Krusty, that sure was a tall tale. <laughs> <laughs> and tall oh gosh, more the messages.
very first dinosaur bones ever discovered were in England in the early 1800s. These fossils belonged to an iguanodon. They left many footprints which can be seen even today. Their 12,000 pound weight could have easily crushed a small car. Iguanodons actually had hands with pointed spikes for thumbs. And they traveled in great herds, making them a formidable force to reckon with. Another fascinating Factosaurus. Stick around for a hot and happening adventure on an all-new CBS Story Break. Coming up next, right here on Kid TV. There's a mystery inside every bowl of new undercover bear's oatmeal. To discover it, just stir. Bears? Undercover bears. Mmm, it's good. It's gone. Who can resist the oatmeal with soft, chewy bears that appear when you stir? Tempting maple brown sugar bears. Strawberry, too. And part of this balanced breakfast. Breakfast? Here he is. I've got it. New undercover bear's oatmeal. Taste closed. This is CBS. American Heart Association is fighting for your life. I'm Bob Keeshan. Welcome to CBS Story Break. Usually it's fun when a relative comes for a visit. But what would you think if a relative showed up whom nobody remembered? That's what happens to Tim and Beth when great Aunt Emma arrives at their house. And that is when the trouble starts. Today's story is about a close encounter of a dangerous kind. Based on Nicholas Fisk's book, here is Grinny. Maybe your sister has. Beth. I'm coming. Uh-oh. What is it, Beth? Uh, nothing, Mom. Oh, well, come on, then. Let's go help wash the car. Be right there. Four, five. He in trouble. Hey, watch it, kid. <laughs> Hey, you guys want your dog back? Oh, hi, Edgar. You know Spike always runs away on that day. Spike! Uh-huh, so Spike is the culprit. Fella, 
Oh, Dad, he's a growing dog. He needs his daily sandal. Is that so? Well, in that case, I'll give him the other one and he'll have a match set. <laughs> Your great aunt Emma, you remember me. I'm sorry, I don't, but. Hello, may I help you? She says she's my great aunt Emma. Mom, do I have one? <sighs> Not that I know of. Oh, I'm sure you remember me. <laughs> Beth, this is your great aunt Emma, uh, the one we're always talking about. Who did you say it was, dear? You know my aunt Emma. Well, funny, I, I don't. Uh... Of course, you remember me. Oh, Aunt Emma, how have you been? Will you be staying long? And this, of course, is the backyard. Oh, walk out for the pool. Hey, Aunt Emma, I'm going to make some lemonade. Would you like some? No, thank you. I never drink. Oh. And what sort of creature is that? I know it's dirty, but there's a dog in there someplace. Come on, Beth, we need to make a trip to the store. And Emma, you're welcome to come along. for the prize. Well, you're supposed to buy it first. Oh, that won't be necessary. You'll remember me. Of course I remember you, Aunt Emma. Here, let me help you. Taking a little walk. After these messages. Listen, here he comes. Wow, oh, Jack. Hey, we better finish our Cheerios. Yeah. It's part of this complete breakfast. Whoa. Come on, guys. 
a shark hunt in every bowl. Catch all three shark shapes, you win! Thank goodness for Chef And now back to CBS Storybook. all the noise. I'm telling Mom and Dad about you. Do you seriously expect us to believe that your great Aunt Emma tried to hurt you? Or that she has a mechanical arm? Well, I'm surprised at both of you. What did I do? You're older than Beth. We expect you to be more responsible. You kids both have overactive imaginations. Now, maybe you should go to your rooms and think about what you've said and done. Oh. What do you play, Great Aunt Emma? 
Yeah. Hey, watch it. Come on, Great Aunt Emma. It's only water. Did you hear that noise she made? That was just the sprinklers. You'll believe me soon. Then you'll be sorry. Hey, your aunt left her bag. Where'd she go? That way. Aunt Emma, wait. But I didn't ask you to bring me my bag, Tim. You should have left it where it was. That was kind of rude and strange. That's what I've been trying to tell you. Now do you believe me? your bedtime. Dad, come here. You won't believe this. Believe what? There's a UFO out there, and it's that spike. It's just lightning. Yeah, lightning. I should have known. You and oh, like I said, you have an overactive imagination. Now, back to sleep, okay? Okay. Good night. After these messages. Here's the perplexing Rufus Aleufus, an urban species known to enter large outdoor cages voluntarily. They're capable of short flights, much like the pterodactyl or the flying fish. Colorations vary by season. However, if you don't see the blue of the Levi's jeans, it's not likely to be a true Lupus. With the Book of Magic, I'll make a new batch of lucky charms. The delicious part of a complete breakfast. A touch of magic. Wow. Ah, I use too much magic. Now my marshmallow colors are all mixed up. Blue hearts, green moons, purple stars. And I can't read the book to fix them. Kids, you've got to help me. If all these mixed up marshmallows get into be lucky charm cereal. They already are. Kids, you can get your own box of mixed up Lucky Charms and help Lucky fix up the mix up. Help me, I mean Lucky Charms to stay mixed up forever. She's baby alive. Giving you a bottle for your meal, you're so healthy. Baby alive. Making fresh food for your tummy. Mm, cherry. Yummy. Baby alive. Changing your diapers when you're through. You're a good baby, too. Batteries not included. Baby alive. 
baby alive. You can really feed her, give her a bottle, and change her diaper. Who are those wretched reptiles battling the badgers? They're the heroes of the half shell. Call them! Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles! Saturday on CBS TV! We're dead brown! And now back to CBS Story Break. Tim, I thought I told you to go back to bed. I just... You remember me and my nightmares. Oh, Aunt Emma, you and your nightmares. All right, all right, it's late. Now back to bed, you two. Yes, yes sir. Daddy. Good night, kids. What happened in there? You wouldn't believe it. Yes, I would. What happened to the UFO? It just disappeared. No use. I guess the UFO really did get Spike. Winnie's stupid face just killed my dog. I hate her. We'll do something, Beth. I promise you. We just need some help. Hey, what's going on out here? Wow, what happened to the grass? Hector, we need your help. Tim, Beth will be gone for a while. Now mind your great Aunt Emma. Okay, Beth, we've got to do it now. It may be our only chance. Great Aunt Emma, Great Aunt Emma, please come. We need you. What is it? It's Tim. He's hurt. Where is Tim? Down there. Oh, oh what can I do? Go down there. So difficult to do that. Yes, great. You may come in now, Tim and Ben. As you may have guessed, I am a new factor in human life. You are going to have to get used to me. Are you going to eat up the something? Oh, my, no. We never eat. We just need energy. You see, we used up our world. So now you want this one? Exactly. Well, what about people who live here now? 
the useful ones, people under our control, will be put to work. And what about us? You can't control us. True. They can't control the children. Your minds are so wild, so unpredictable. But you'll either help us, or you'll have to go away. Why are you telling us this? Aren't you afraid we'll do something to stop you? It's just too late, Tim. Now this message. character and camping seen in every kids club meal at Burger King. The Burger King Kids Club, just for fun, just for you. There's a mystery inside every bowl of new undercover bear's oatmeal. To discover it, just stir. Bears? Undercover bears. Mmm, it's good. It's gone. Who can resist the oatmeal with soft, chewy bears that appear when you stir? Tempting maple brown sugar bears. Strawberry, too. And part of this balanced breakfast. Undercover bears oatmeal. Case closed.
This is CBS. What's the best day to go to Showbiz Pizza? If you feel like going out and having fun, Adopt a team. Be a foster parent. I had been selected for a most important journey. I was to help fulfill the destiny of the two great ones, Bill and Ted. Wild Stallions rule! 